I cannot stress enough the importance of being in a relationship where two people are giving their all. When we live our lives willing to take risks, we open up doors to some of the most incredible things that we could ever experience. But we also open up doors to potentially being hurt or being embarrassed. And that can be a really scary thing, especially if we don't know who we really are and if we aren't confident in that. Unfortunately, nowadays, you know, we have these preconceived ideas and, and these pressures almost of, of what relationships should look like and what the person we are with should look like. And we kind of chase after these physical thrills and we look at the external stuff. We look at people's pictures and we think of the pictures that we want to post. The fact that we want to be with someone that our friends might even be jealous of and our friends might approve of physically. And the thing that's sad about that is that there will be all these red flags. There will be all these things that might come up. and. We continue to just compromise and compromise and compromise and settle and settle and settle all because we kind of see this thing for what it could be because our, our measurement is all based off of the external and you know I've been in relationships like this I have friends who are in relationships like this even now where they're dating somebody and they're, they're almost dating them off of the potential of who they could someday maybe eventually become and you know they'll, they'll say things like you don't know them like I do or they're really you know, striving to be this. And although, trust me, I'm a firm believer in, in giving people grace and giving forgiveness and allowing people to have flaws. Nobody is perfect. But there's a fine line between that and being in a relationship where we just allow someone to walk all over us and to cheat on us or to verbally abuse us or even to physically abuse us simply because we've become so distracted from the things that really matter in a relationship. And when I wrote All or Nothing, I was just thinking a lot about this and how I've been in relationships in the past like this where people didn't give me their all and yet for some reason I found myself going back and going back and going back. And All or Nothing is kind of my song to myself in setting the standard of what a relationship should be. There's a line in this song that says, I'm just gonna put this all on you. You know, basically, I've made my decision, now you have to make yours. And if your decision isn't the same as mine, then, then I need to walk out and I need to find something better. When we think about the health of a relationship, a relationship cannot be healthy if two people aren't committed to each other in the midst of imperfections, committed to still loving one another and forgiving one another and, and prioritizing one another. A relationship just can't work if people aren't willing to do those things. And so again, this, this song is just something that I kind of wrote to myself as the standard of what I want for relationships. And I, I can say that I am with one of the most incredible women that I have ever met in my entire life. But that hasn't come easy. I've made my mistakes in relationships. I've been hurt in relationships. But when I met Carrie, nothing compares to what I have with her. And I'm so grateful for the fact that I didn't allow myself to settle, that I didn't allow myself to compromise just because it was maybe scary to walk away from those things that felt good in the moment, even though I knew that, that they weren't good in the long run. And I encourage you guys, you know, be the kind of person that's willing to take risks and to give your all, but that's also willing to raise the bar enough and to be patient enough to wait for that right person who, who is also going to give you their all. Thank you guys so much for checking out this little vlog on the deeper meaning behind my song, All or Nothing. Make sure you get the song on iTunes. Check out all the episodes of D+, and I'll see you guys soon.